most obvious one of all is the yellow wall. The southern side of Borussia Dortmund is the largest freestanding terrace in Europe and it holds up to 25,000 fans and this bunch allowed. <laughs> making the Westfalen Stadion one of the most intimidating stadiums for away teams. With cheap tickets, beer and brat bursts, this has got to be one of the most impressive and cost effective away trips. The Blood Brothers. If you've got the pennies, try to get to Germany for the Blood Brothers derby, St Pauli versus Union Berlin, a game featuring two of Deutschland's coolest clubs. Back when Union were fighting bankruptcy, both Union and St Pauli fans got together and helped save the club in the most ingenious way. In Germany, you are compensated for giving blood, and the fan base from both clubs used this as a way of making money for the struggling side. All this makes this derby a whole lot of fun. The Eternal Derby. Red Star Belgrade versus Partizan Belgrade, the local derby in, you guessed it, Belgrade, Serbia. This is one of the most fierce rivalries out there, so pack an extra pair of pants. The Sarajevo derby. Sarajevo is one of my favourite cities. It's seeped in history with reminders of the war everywhere. Here you'll find one of the most heated games in Europe, Zvezdnichar versus FK Sarajevo, Bosnia's biggest and most popular teams. Expect a singing and pyro-induced ruckus. El Clasico. It is now even more important to get to an El Clasico than ever before. With five of the best attacking players in the world, it's hard to imagine a better game of football. Cover that with an electric atmosphere, it turns into Europe's biggest club game. The Super Clasico. The Super Clasico is a fixture of fixtures. Many of football's biggest stars have propelled themselves to legendary status after great performances in this game. The shows that the fan groups put on during this match is unparalleled. If you're based or traveling in South America, make sure you catch this game. The Champions League. The Champions League 2015-16 reignites in mid-Feb with some absolute ronker stonkers being played out. Chelsea return to Paris, Arsenal test their wits against the mighty Barcelona and Juve play Bavarian behemoths Bayern. Who knows who will win this tournament, however you can bet it's going to be great watching. Euro 2016. You can it be a summer of football and thankfully 2016 will feature the Euros in France. The group stages have already pitched up some corkers. England will face Wales, the Belgians will take on the Italians and old school powerhouses Austria and Hungary are matched up. You don't even need a ticket. Get to France and soak up some summer soccer vibes in the copious amounts of fan parks. With fans from all over Europe flocking to France, it's going to be the footballing feature of the year. So that's it. We hope you've taken notes and can check out as many of these as possible. But if you can't, we'll be covering all the action at Copper 90. Make sure to subscribe. Peace.